Okay, here we are. You can see the uh, pulley there with a ratchet on it. You can see the two white dots. The engine is almost at top dead center first cylinder. I've removed the spark plugs. They're here, the charge packs, the spark plugs, and here's the two tools. That's the HCB tool below the ruler and my tool above the ruler. You can see that my tool is about 10 millimeters longer than the HCB tool. I'll now pick up the HCB tool and get under the car. And I will install the tool. Here we are. Here's the tool. It's going up in here. It's kind of hard to get it in, but anyway. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Right, it's in. Okay, so the HCV tool is all the way in, and I'll show you that. Alrighty. As you can see, it's all the way in. Now the tool, the tool has gone all the way in, just focus here, the tool has gone all the way in and yet the engine can still be cranked. The tool is not in the flywheel, right, I've just gone past top dead centre. Right, I'll bring it around again, if the tool had locked into the hole, in the flywheel, I wouldn't be able to crank this engine. So I'll bring it around close to top dead centre again. There it is, that's close enough. I'll now go and take the HCB tool out. There it is, you can see it's still there. Hopefully it's focused. It out. Right out. Here we are. There it is. Let's take it out. There it is again. I'll now take my tool, which is ten millimeters longer. Stick it in. There we are. My tool. Focus, please. Mm. Not easy to do. There we are. And I will now put that in. It's a little bit tricky because it's a bit longer. But there we are. Right now it's in, but it's not all the way in. See if I can show that. Right, so you can see there, the tool is in, but it's not all the way in. There we are, I'll focus on it. Alrighty, well what I'll do is I'll ask Carolyn to now bring top dead centre up to the white dot. If you can do that. I'm doing it now. Righto. I'll start pushing the tool in. It's turning. Righto, tell me when you think it's about close. Close now. Well, it's hard. I'll just keep jiggling. Right, it's okay. just about a, a little bit more. Yes, I'm moving it, moving it, moving it. Is it there yet? It's there now. Touch more. Good, it's in. Right, is that it? That's it. Yeah, I think it's all the way in. Try moving forward or back. Right. Can't do it. Oh, I can't do it forward. No, can't do it back. Oh, I can't try it back. Hang on, I'm not on a good angle to try back yet. Okay, my tool has gone all the way in. I'll just try and video that. 
There it is. Okay. Now uh, we'll come up and we'll have a look. Let's just focus there. And there we are. I'll grab the ratchet and the engine doesn't move forwards and Oops, well, of course the ratchet has got to be... And the engine doesn't move backwards. It's locked. Because the tool is long enough to reach the hole in the flywheel. I'll now go and take it out. And the engine will turn again. Let's see what we've got here. Where's the tool? There it is. Focusing on the tool, you can see it's in the hole there. Yep, there it is there. I'll take it out. It's a bit hard to get out. It's just a tiny bit longer than the other one. Can you take the tension off the um, flywheel? I oh, know, that's right, it's out. Pull that out. Just a tiny bit long. There it is. Yeah. Right, here we go. Uh. I really should get a hoist, you know. I wonder if David sells hoists. And there we are. You can see the difference in length. It is one centimetre difference in length. There we go, folks. This is a manual car. A manual BMW. Show you the engine number here. There it is. N46B20. BA. See that? N46. B20, BA, and the car is a manual six-speed car. Alrighty, all done.